Hi, this is Mr. Giles with another short tutorial. Uh, this is how to edit sound effects either for volume or length in um, Clipchamp. Well, okay, so here's an example. My character, there's a running sound. Um, stick figure blue guy is knocking stick figure black guy off the cliff. So we go watch and he uh, the running is still happening, but he's already done running. So this quick running side to side sound effect right here. All you have to do is when you click on it, you'll see there's a green handle that's put on both ends. And when I put my mouse and I hover my mouse over the edges here, you'll see it turns into double arrow. So I'm going to shorten that whole sound. And I'm going to go see where is the spot where his feet leave the ground. And it's right, um, let's see, right there. So I'm going to shorten that sound right back to there so that the running stops. And he jumps. And I'll probably add another sound right there. That's, that's the easy way. Now let's say the sound is really loud. Here's a scream coming up. Maybe the sound is too loud. So if you click on the sound, you'll see that there's an option. It even says scream six wave right here. And um, you can adjust the volume. So let's just adjust it way lower and see what that sounds like. I'm going to grab my, my scroll bar here. And I'm going to hit play um, by hitting space bar, hopefully, or play. And that's a lot quieter, and I don't like it, so I'm going to adjust it up a little more. 70%. Hit spacebar or play again. There we go. I like that. So there's how you do that. And by the way, if you didn't notice, you can stack multiple sounds at a time. So multiple things can be happening. Someone's falling, someone's walking, someone's laughing. You can have all those sounds happening at once, plus you can add music. We'll do another tutorial on adding music, but you should always start with your sound effects before you start adding music. Thanks a lot, Mr. Giles. There are several other ClipChamp tutorials on my page, so you can just, you know, look for them, search the, search the page for uh, ClipChamp, and you'll probably find a whole bunch of different tutorials as they relate to Pivot or just video editing in general. Have a great day.